Uh, hey guys, today we are going to make um, a Christmas wreath with a bow, like a Christmas wreath with a Christmas bow. Okay, so I had some problems like while choosing the balloons because I didn't have light green color, I took some purple. Uh, if you have light green, then please take light green. I didn't have some. So, okay, now this is light green. I didn't have dark green. So, yeah. If you have dark green, then it's very good. Otherwise, you can use purple or blue. Otherwise, um, buy some. Spread up. Okay. So we have a green balloon. For a green purple balloon, we don't want extra long nozzles. We are just going to do a normal pump. Remember, you shouldn't leave much space at the back. Right. Because we just need space for two lock turns and some coils, not more than that. Okay. What is on nozzle? And that's just for time. If you can tie without a long nozzle. Then please do that. How do you tie that? Okay, for water. Okay, yeah, I got it. I know you can see everything green because the balloon is right on the camera. So, yeah, now it's an option. Oh, okay, anyways. I'm doing it on the wrong hand, sorry. Sorry about the videos. Alright. So now for the green and purple balloon, you don't need much space at the back, as I already said. And you don't even need some special type of nozzle, like extra long. Alright. Or extra short nozzle. You don't need things like that. In this video, you can even request for any other balloon animal or something you would like with balloons. And you could even request for my shorts if you have subscribed yet. And if you haven't, please subscribe. Uh, it should come in there. I think so, it should. I think so, I think so. Yeah, now that's better, right? All right, so it took me not um, much time to do my purple balloon, I guess. So oh, that was just a joke. Now the red balloon, as you all know, for the bow tie, um, bow thing, actually. I don't know what you call that, bow tie. Is going to go uh, somewhere like this, and you need okay, you uh, yeah, you need an extra long nozzle for that, and uh, just leave a little more space at the back. Like normally, we leave not much space, but there should be a little more space. Okay, so now I have a hole in my red balloon, which is like right near the nozzle. So, I'll just hide that in the knot. That's why I'm making the extra long now. Otherwise, why would I do that? So, I have just this much space. So, I try my best. Uh, okay, do this. Anyways, I got the four treated. Well, that wasn't a pole, that was just a dent in the Okay, that much extra space will be absolutely fine. Any extra space is left, don't worry. 
print that below. Okay, now good that I fill in the solution because now I'll be able to tell you what to do. Get that hole at the back of the knot and then tie the knot. That's it. Otherwise, just take a new button. So, yeah. Okay, then come Okay, pretty much forward how to do, do the uh, knot properly. So, yeah. Uh, okay, I got it, I guess. Oh, yeah, got it. Remember the Oh, now the knot not a strike. I can't do anything but let me move it on. I'm just a big by this. Special. Yeah, it's not coming out. Need a run. Okay. That's pretty much it. Uh, now I fix the bell and get back to you. Alright, so I uh, fixed the uh, dent thingy. Like I just cut off the part. So as you can see. So now I inflated my red, red bell about like this much space at the back. A little more than the green and purple ones. So yeah. Okay. So now what we are going to do is first we are going to work with the green and purple ones, which are um, pretty much the hard part. So let's see. All right. Yeah. By the way, uh, you can skip the intro till here. And if you want to see the materials needed and all, you can see that in the description for it's written. Not my problem. All right. So yeah, for things needed in the description, it's all written and a special announcement is also there. Please read that because I didn't get any, I don't think I did get any comments on my uh, previous video from Jack Sparrow and no new subscribers too. So yeah, anyways, we have two pillows over here, purple and green. Uh, it should be light, uh, dark green and light green, but I didn't have dark green as I always have told in this video. So what we are going to do now, it's a little complicated. We are going to do a lock turn, but this time it's going to be a little different. So we are going to do that between the two buildings. So basically joining the both. So it's something like this. Then what we do is we get one of them to another side. Tie it around something like that. And then exchange the colors. So it should look like this. Now this is a tight balloon thing, so it never goes off. Now what we do is wrap my chair off. Okay, I'll change the view for this one. Okay, right. uh, view change. From here we start coiling it up like that. Okay. Quite a hard part. So hard. 
pretty hard to coil on both the ones. And some this much is left on the back. Okay, we do that once again. Remember, if you're using thin balloons, like thinner than mine, which are not so much available in the market, I don't think so. They are. Okay. Start. It's hard holding on to them. You can't just keep holding on to them. They are good. So if you have a partner with you, you very well. Then when these are equal, and then they are going to drop them over here too. All right. So in the end, this is how it's going to do. Totally call it up. All right. And then comes the hard part. We're going to lock these both also. So, hard to So, basically, a lock term with two basic terms. We have just get two till now. This one's going to be four. Okay. So, you can make better than mine, clearly. Because the coils will come so good. Uh, Anyways, so, yeah. so that um, okay, I don't like this much. Written. All right. So it should look like this, like if you have made better than mine, then congratulations. Otherwise, yeah, like this. Then we are going to take a red balloon to make the bow. So I'll again change the view basically. Yeah, changing the view, wait. Okay, here we have it. Right. Yeah. So first thing is clear. You basically need to do a basic turn over here to make the bow. All right. So now we are going. All right, something like that. I don't think I left enough space. Then we do a loop turn over here like this. Okay. Then we do a really small basic turn. I think so. I said okay, it shouldn't be so small, also. So I just the thing so that it goes straight like that. Okay. Then all right, my previous basic term went like this. Oh, okay. So, yeah. Take all the space you can in the end. Let's press more. Yep. The big one. Yeah, no, that's like it. All right. Now I have quite space. Something like that. Okay. Then we are going to see how big uh yeah this basic turn is, and then we uh according to that measuring, we are going to make all the other turns. All right. Okay. So According to me, we make something like this small. Okay. If we go to sphere like that, yeah, that looks better. Okay. And then we 
going to make something like this. Yeah. And then we are just here to make it look like a bowl. Alright. I know this story does not look like a bow, but when we attach it to there, it's going to be pretty obvious how it does. One step is Then you can even Okay, I pretty much messed up on this. Oh, yeah, no. Now it looks like a hole. All right. Just the sword, but yeah, it's good enough. Now we take our thingy and so we basically want the whole thing to look like this. I know it's pretty hard attaching it to it, uh, that, but it's not so hard of here. So basically, just need to do a lock between all the six of them, which is really hard. Okay, I can't do it. Okay, so now you know you need to do a lock, so I do that in some time. Back in some time. Alright. Just a look. It should look something like this. Oops. Nice, right? I changed the view and show it to you properly. So yeah. Mm -hmm. Should take this. I mean, this thing you shouldn't come in between. I can just squeeze it away. Okay. Yeah. So if you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Ring the notification bell for more videos, right? Yeah. It's done. All right. I'm sure to make it. Thank you, folks. All right. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.